Ukrainian President Petro Poroshenko has confirmed that Ukrainian military forces are withdrawing from Debaltseva. The Ukrainian leader stated early on February 18th that the withdrawal was underway in a, quote, planned and organized way and said that 80 percent of troops and military equipment had already left the city. President Poroshenko is reportedly now on his way to the conflict zone in East Ukraine. Ukrainian news agency TSN quoted Poroshenko as saying, I can now confirm that early on February 18th, Ukrainian armed forces, alongside National Guard units, completed a planned and organized withdrawal of military units from Debaltseva. <laughs> President Poroshenko claimed that the withdrawal of Ukrainian forces was evidence that the troops had not been encircled completely, despite such claims being widespread in the Russian media. Debaltseva has long been one of the main objectives of Russian-backed militant forces in East Ukraine. The town is a key transport hub controlling rail and road connections between the militant-occupied cities of Donetsk and Luhansk. It also offers greatly improved rail access to Russia itself, raising the prospect of Russian military supplies reaching militant forces by a train and reducing Moscow's dependence on so-called humanitarian convoys. Militant attacks on Debaltseva escalated in recent weeks and continued after February 15th, despite the introduction of a ceasefire regime agreed to following marathon diplomatic talks in Belarus capital Minsk.